Hey everyone, this is Nadia from the Cognito Forms team. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can quickly and easily create cascading dropdowns on your forms using the lookup field. Cascading dropdowns are also known as dynamic or dependent dropdowns, and they're essentially a series of related dropdown menus. So depending on what options you select in one dropdown, the next dropdown will automatically filter the available choices. For this example, we're going to add some cascading dropdowns to this Cognito Coffee customer survey form. Cognito Coffee is sadly not a real business, but let's pretend that it is and that we have several stores across multiple cities. Because some cities have more than one store, I want my customers to be able to select their city first and then select their store from a list of locations based on their specific city. To get started, I went ahead and created a form for my store locations. For each location, I included a location name, the address, and the city it's in. Next, let's open up our customer survey form. At the top of this form, I want to include two dropdowns, a list of cities and a list of locations. First, I'm going to add a lookup field to pull in the locations. So now you can see the lookup field is pulling in all five store locations from our locations form. Next, we need to pull in the list of cities. To do this, I'm going to select the Add Cascade Filter option and then filter the list by city. Adding a cascade filter creates a new field on your form that displays a list of filtered choices. You can think of the cascade filter as a subfield of the lookup field. They're directly tied together, and deleting the lookup field will delete the cascade filter as well. Now our cascade filter field will display a list of cities based on our location's lookup field. This next step is optional, but if you'd like, you can set the default location to change based on the city selected. You can also set the locations field to only appear once the city field is filled out. Again, this is just an option to make your form feel a bit more dynamic. Also, keep in mind that you can add up to three cascade filters to a single lookup field. This feature really comes in handy when you're dealing with a lot of data or you just want to make it easier for people to fill out your forms. If you have any questions about cascading dropdowns or the lookup field, be sure to reach out to us at help.cognitoforms.com.